Hello friends, this is Ganesh. Hope you are doing great. A quick um, clarification about the difference between commit work and BAPI transaction commit. So there were some questions about these two. So I thought, okay, let's have a quick video on this. Let's get into the slide first. To understand the difference between these two, let's understand um, the terminology called commit work and commit work and wait how these two works so in sap we normally have uh, the terminology called asynchronous and synchronous okay it's very simple so commit work is work as a asynchronous process and commit work and wait is work uh, in the pros of synchronous okay so one more difference what is asynchronous what is synchronous the people who, uh, who are not aware of that so asynchronous is mostly um, it's it doesn't wait for any response so this process we normally used whenever there is a request sent to update any document in your sap for example the pi process uh, it works in the both way asynchronous and synchronous and luw also logical unit of work also we have this process asynchronous and synchronous meaning it send a request to update some document in your SAP and there are two options whether the, the request can wait for the response or the request cannot wait for the response. So it depends on the business process and depends on the way how you are developing your project based on that you have to choose whether the process to be asynchronous or synchronous. So you can say okay only asynchronous is work for my own uh, a project so what I can do is you can go with commit work okay I don't want to wait till the response comes from the back end or where you are expecting so in that case you can use commit work so it work as a asynchronous it won't wait for the response it's keep on it's keep moving on commit work and wait statement is synchronous it wait for the response once you uh, send a request to update anything to the backend it wait for the response once it, the update is done then only it will go to the next statement so that is called synchronous okay so now you have a clear little clear idea about what is commit work and what is commit work and wait and when you have to use it okay now BAPI transaction commit okay that act as commit work and act as a commit work and wait meaning that can work in two process either it may be work as a asynchronous process or it may work as a synchronous process okay so that is everything is depends on your own need so here i'm just replacing both statements so with BAPI transaction commit so that can work as a commit as an asynchronous process whenever you have the um, input parameter called weight is empty so if you if you not pass the, the x value to the weight parameter then BAPI transaction commit does work as an asynchronous process. So this, whenever you pass the x to the weight parameter that work as a synchronous process. So there is a difference between the commit work and tran BAPI transaction commit. So commit work is always asynchronous but BAPI has an option of it may be asynchronous or it may be synchronous okay so there's the only difference between these two and if you want you can add it so whenever there is a, a, a program is defined or designed using a BAPI after that you have to use BAPI transaction commit so probably why they prefer is probably it's actually a remote enable from it's app API right so whenever there is a call happening from the other system it's always better go with the um, synchronous process so just wait and get the response and go back but still there is a depends on the business need you can keep the BAPI transaction commit as asynchronous or synchronous okay so the main difference between commit work and BAPI is commit work is always asynchronous but BAPI has the option of either it can act as an asynchronous process or it can act as a synchronous process so hope this might give a little clarity about the difference between commit work and BAPI transaction commit. Okay. And as I mentioned, if you want, you can add some more statements. Um, after BAPI is preferable, you can add a BAPI transaction commit, but this is the main difference between these two. Okay. And yeah, so whatever I explain the same thing in another slide. So commit work is always asynchronous. Commit BAPI transaction commit work with weight is a process of synchronous. If you want this to be asynchronous, yes, you can use it. 
Okay, that gives some clarity about the difference. Thank you so much. See you in the next video. Bye.